We're rolling. Okay. Hi. Hi, Mom. Hi. How are you doing? Good. Making my mask. Oh, that's great. So, I'm doing a film for Life in the Day. Mm hmm And I wanted to give people a taste of life in Edmonton. Okay. As it is today. Okay. So, I'm just going to ask you a few questions I want everyone to answer here. Okay. What's one thing that you love? About Edmonton or just... Just in general. Uh, freedom. Freedom? Yeah. Okay. And then what's one thing that you fear? Uh... Boy, these are deep questions. <laughs> one thing that I fear... Violence. Violence, yeah. And if you could change one thing about either the world or your life, what would it be? <laughs> uh, peace. You want more Harmony. peace in the world? Harmony. Harmony and peace. Yeah. Okay. And what do you think about life in Edmonton or in Alberta? Overall, it's pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. What do you like about it? Uh, people are... Well, people are more or less friendly. Um, but I like, I like the fresh air. I like the open spaces, the blue skies, the green nature. Um, it's a very... Uh, peaceful place to live mm -hmm. like like environmentally and everything yeah yeah okay and as you know we're going through tumultuous international times right now mm -hmm. so I was wondering what you thought about the current world situation right now um, <laughs> in regards to what all kinds of things uh, the police the quarantine the economy well, the quarantine, it is what it is. I mean, people way back when had to be, deal with the Black Plague and other things like that. So, I mean, I guess technology has been good for us in that sense because I'm sure we're better prepared to deal with this than they were back then. Um, so, I mean, things go, come and go, right? Mm -hmm. So things like diseases come and go, and it's, uh, it's although it's new for us to go through something like this, it's not new for the world. Um, and it's just I I would say in the history of the world, it's just part of life, and it's something we have to deal with the best that we can. And I think it kind of proves the mark of humanity, of how well we've developed or not. Right. Um, in regards to Black Lives Matter. And all the police violence, I think, I think it's good. I think, you know, I'm not a black person. I haven't felt discriminated against, but I believe that they have. And I mean, you hear about how, how black people have to teach their children how to behave um, so that they don't get shot. And that's, I mean, that's something I haven't had to do with you, right? So obviously it, it, it exists and not just for black people, but indigenous people, you know? So I think there, there's a, a, a massive mental shift that has to happen. So, you know, it's good for them that it's happening. Uh, they say like things like COVID-19 pandemics increases the violence. And so this was an opportunity for them. It was time for them to really get attention and to really be able to change people's minds and to make people aware. So it's a, it's a good thing to me because I think a lot of us lived in ignorance. Good enough? <laughs> yeah. Well, that was perfect. Just a couple more questions, if you don't mind. Yeah. And what do you hope for in the future? I don't know. Peace and harmony, really, but I mean, that's not... That's exactly what the last guy said. Oh. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah. Um, I think one thing good about this COVID shift, this COVID uh, pandemic, is that it's. I think it's brought us back to, closer to to nature, and to be less busy, and to be less um, less urban. You know, people are people are cooking more. People are home more, doing things more at home. Um, yeah. So I think in the future, I, I, because I think we spend too much time, we were in a race, everyone was in a race, and we spend too much time working and on our computers and um, at our jobs and just in a rat race with the market. And I think um, my hope for the future is that we take more time to be with nature and to be home and to just... Um, because I find, you know, we're, we're not, we weren't in harmony. We're out of balance. So I think that, uh, yeah, to find more balance, I guess. Okay. Well, uh, I don't know if this already answered the last question I had, but uh, what's one message that you want the whole world to hear? Um... that I guess we're all human. We're, as I've been saying at the COVID thing, we're all in this together. Um, I think that's, that's it. <laughs> all right. Thanks a lot, mom. Okay. Bye. Love you. <laughs> Love you. <laughs>